taking to the podium to deliver the presidency's budget vote. But incidents of increasing violence against women still dominating. And they call for the society to unite against the scourge. Thank you. We need to unite as communities and all sectors, from business, traditional leaders, faith-based communities, and others, to promote safer communities. Turning to other pressing well, issues, include the president said he is not opposed to the Commission on State Capture, United, as some quarters have made that call. We fully support an inquiry as it will help to uncover the facts and remove rumors about the extent of capture. What has caused a delay is the manner in which the former public protector directed that the inquiry should be done. On the issue of nuclear power, he said his government was committed to an affordable level for the country. We reiterate that the program will be implemented at a pace and scale that the country can afford. President Zuma spoke about progress in transforming the economy, assisting state-owned entities, and the drive to the get the youth empowered. Sadek. But the opposition was not impressed, accusing the president of ruining the country. I am sick to death of reading every weekend emails about how our state has been sold off to someone else. I would rather be reading about the vision of our country. I remind you here and now, he, because I can't address to him as a man or a woman, he has killed the ANC. We will not allow him to kill South Africa. The most important thing, honorable members, and the most important prominent failing is this handling of the National Development Plan. I've repeatedly said that if the National Development Plan was implemented, it would be a great legacy for, for the president. Opposition parties and governing party MPs debated the presidency's budget vote late into the night. President Zuma will reply on Thursday. Mzwande Lembej, SAPC News, Parliament.